I'm a farmer. I don't know. I don't know how to speak to 20 people at one time, let alone a crowd like this. But I think you people have proven something to the world. Not only to town of Bethel or Sullivan County or New York State, you've proven something to the world. This is the largest group of people ever assembled in one place. The important thing that you've proven to the world is that a half a million kids, and I call you kids because I have children older than you are, a half a million young people can get together and have three days of fun and music and have nothing but fun and music, and I God bless you for it. In the summer of 1969, over 400,000 people gathered on a New York dairy farm for three days of peace and music. The festival forever changed music history and its surrounding culture. Mr. Mark Pachoni, a math teacher at El Dorado, was lucky enough to attend Woodstock when he was just 16 years old. My older cousin called me and said, let's go to Woodstock. And at first I was unsure, I was, felt I was a little bit young, but what convinced me to go was that my grandfather, who was our common grandfather, uh, had a little farm up by Woodstock. So we could actually go visit my grandfather, stay with him, and then go to the festival. Although Mr. Piccioni and his cousin had a place to stay, they were without festival tickets. So I agreed to go because I figured, worst case scenario, I was I'll hang out at my grandfather's farm. So we, we drove up on Friday after work, and the festival was already going on. We went to the festival. By that time, there were so many people there that they couldn't control who was going in and who was going out. The whole ticket situation was meaningless. And it was just big, people just broke down any barriers or fences, and it was just an open festival. In the end, Mr. Piccioni was able to attend all three days of Woodstock. He looks back upon the experience fondly. And that was an amazing experience because of all the amazing music, but all just the whole scene and all those people and all the things I saw that I'd never seen before. And I grew up a lot that weekend, but it was an amazing experience. Well, 